What do I remember from the last time I played this? Getting drunk with some dude and getting teleported to the other side of Skyrim. Besides that, not really much. Uh, I'm supposed to ask, find staff. Hey, Maker. How goes your Sunday? Priestess is at fell. Okay, I'm supposed to find him at Rorikstead. Rorikstead from here. There is. Tell Perth that the Draugr are dead, and then Rorikstead's over there. I would uh, love to tell Perth. This is the thing where, like, it opens at a weird time, isn't it? And it's, like, middle of the... We'll come back and tell Perth later. I'm doing well. Just finished up Disney villain Lego set that's, like, VHS uh, cases. Hopefully the back pain gets better. Back pain is decidedly not fun. I mean, pain is not fun, so. Do I have to... Who wants to go make some gin? Oof. Hopefully it is short term. I have known people to have very long term pinched back nerves and it is the opposite of fun. Something here. Got a horse. These trees are really making me want a gin and tonic, man. friend just killed it before anyone had a chance to realize what was going on. Let's see, where exactly is this? Oh, hi. How did that not hit you? There's another one, but where is it? That's not good. Okay, Death Hound just came out of nowhere. Um, the conjured weapons are some of the strongest weapons in the game for a very long time. They also, more importantly, do not have a need to keep track of ammo. Um, 
and if you level up Conjuring, can have auto soul bind or auto soul trap on hit. So especially when you get later on, you have access to a whole bunch of enchanted gear that needs to stay charged. It's really easy to keep soul gems charged with conjured weapons. Plus, they're treated as bows. And um, their damage scales with both your archery and your conjuring. For the most part, spellcasting in Skyrim is kind of garbage. Um, Uh, it's only scaling is on MP cost, which, yes, that's consistent with other Elder Scrolls titles, but in other Elder Scrolls titles, as you leveled up, you would get access to stronger spells. You couldn't cast a, a high-level spell unless you were high-level. Uh, in Skyrim, if you can find the tombstone that teaches it, you can learn it whenever. What level primarily does is um, affect what shopkeepers will stock. There, Death Hound dealt with. So this, well, let's use this bow specifically as an example. Normally, you need to have Conjuration 50 before this bow will show up in a shop. But there is... There is a book that teaches it hidden in a bucket in that fort. If you can get to there and get to that bucket, you can have Conjuration bow really early in the game. Far earlier in the game really intends you to have it. And the bows are... Um, well, the conjured weapons are roughly on par with Daedric, is my understanding. In terms of, like, the damage they deal. Where are the vampires? Uh oh, a coffin. And they're decent. And I also still have the thing that says I don't care about your weight limit. Yep, Daedric is pretty much okay. the strongest available. In terms of weaponry. Go. Back here. There's another one. Let's see if I can find it without getting myself into trouble. being a touch annoying. So there's two thralls outside. Let me 
let's see if we can Does it show up in here? Show up in here. That is a fox, I don't want to shoot that. Very pretty sky. And then, there's Neon Cat. That is not left strafe. That is the shortcut button. the wolves. Go. So I'm, what is seeing me? Ah! Yep, there's the wolves. But it matters because my damn cat just wrecked them. It's a little guy. Of course, they're literally in the camp. I just kept finding them somewhere else for some damn reason. Take like seven. Having a hard time making it through two damn vampiric thralls. Yeah, I probably need some better armor. And maybe some points into health. I am pretty glass cannony right now. Harvestable tree. I mean, a lot of the issue is not being able to figure out where they were hanging out because it's dark and I kept running into other things. Do I? I have. to remember what that damn button is there. I mean, I got oak flesh. The main issue is that you can't cast anything else while the bow is out. Because when you put the bow away, it uns it uh, despawns. They're on vastly different timers, but yeah. 
This is a one minute timer. That's useful. Uh, once I get illusion leveled up, that's more of an option, but the large issue is that spellcasting, until you get your illusion up, is loud. How did that... That, like, flew right between the two of them. Good lord. Okay. I don't know how I managed to take her out that easily early on, but holy crap does she hurt. Now, now that I know where they are, I can see them pretty well. It's mostly just like I need to aim for the right one. Just a touch closer, and then... Where's the mage? There's the mage. Had to approach it properly. Get wrecked. Kindly ignore that you wrecked me like six times first. We don't talk about that. Basement. Oh, the coffin's not empty this time. Got a large sack. We've got and chest under here. Thank you. And now we have some caves. I advise against that. Over here. Oh, we've got a master on that. Uh, how did they not hit you? How, how did that not hit you? Seriously, how is nothing hitting you? There we go, good lord. So let's... Uh, 
let's see. Just throw. No, right. Vampires turn into like piles of dust, don't they? There you are. Can we cook? Can cook. Cabbage potato soup. A horse haunch. A leg of goat roast. So if I add cabbage to my potato soup, it does literally nothing. Got it. Yeah, one point of health a second is uh, real useful, guys. Six minutes for... No, oh, that's more than six minutes. Twelve minutes. Just borrowing their cook pot to cook at. No big. Oh, I could make a lot of that. We are preparing to just shove our mouth full of uh, food when it's time to do so. When I need. I don't think I've built a house yet, nah. You, like, get the ability to buy a house in Sky, in, um, Whiterun, right? And most of the cities, honestly, I think. Okay, I'm bored, that's enough food. Someone really wants me to make some gin today, huh? Bloody tankard. Yep, um, no thank you. Well, oh, there's a draugr. Neat. Where'd it come from again? An ash pile. Chest. Leather boots of trampling. What? <laughs> Jump in combat to stun nearby enemies. Okay. Uh, looks like this place is just the one room. I could sleep in the coffin if I wanted. Why would I want to sleep in the coffin though? I took the boots, but, I mean, I am stealthy.
Where they? Leather boots of trampling. There. I'm sorry, what now? Summoned permanently? Chef's hat. Okay. How long have I had that? Also, where's the exit? Hello, random Draugr. Thank you for your salt and your moss. Seriously, how'd I get there? <laughs> 